my name is Professor Thomas Lenartz. I'm the chairman and professor of Department Otolaryngology, Hanover Medical School. The Sentio system is an um, innovative bone conduction device which helps patients with conductive and also mixed hearing loss. It is very advanced and easy to use in surgery, but also for the patient thereafter. The implantation is um, very simple um, and requires only minimal trilling for a bone bed for the recessing of the implant. Um, this is one thing. The other is that we can use a conventional incision behind the ear and uh, expose the bone so that um, from there on um, the drilling can be done. We need a periostal pouch for the antenna part, but this is just lifting up the um, periosteum from the incision line um, so that we can then also see where is the best placement for the implant and uh, then we fix it with a band which means that we just have to place two screws. Now this band is very flexible in its orientation which means that for instance in years where previous surgery has been already done we always can look uh, for the best places for the screws but must not orientate the whole implant um, which is a big advantage um, towards other devices on the market. All this doesn't need a lot of preparation and um, can be done within 30 minutes. Um, also under local anesthesia, which means for elderly patients this is a big advantage uh, compared to other implants. In adults you can think about not using any imaging if that's the philosophy of um, your hospital. Most of the patients really enjoy it. They get uh, indeed improvement in their hearing. The um, important thing is that we stick with the indication rules um, so that a uh, patient really gets enough amplification, enough gain as we say. Um, and then uh, you can more or less guarantee the patient that his hearing will be better uh, than before. The vast majority really has this uh, natural sound quality experience, um, which is also very important for the acceptance of the device and um, also this type of procedure the patient has to undergo.